Oh, and just like that, check it out. I am back here at the Sheriff M house in Virginia, but I'm only here for 24 hours. Because if you didn't see in the last vlog, I came home because today we are doing something super awesome. We're actually going to buy a boat. That's right, Sheriff. We're going to buy a boat. We gotta get going before the storm clouds come in because it's gonna start raining, which means we may not be able to pick up the boat if they don't allow us to take it on the water to test it. But check it out, the Sheriff M house looks absolutely gorgeous here. It's so much fun coming home every time and seeing what is new here. And major shout out to the Tesla for making it all the way from the beach house to here. Kind of drove me an autopilot the whole way. It was super nice. The house looks so good. We, of course, got to check on the pond, though, because, as you know, there used to be a pond monster here. Oh, my God. Ah! Ah! Get up, down. 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 So let's just see. Oh, honestly, the pond monster might be back. What is that stuff? Do you see that? That's disgusting. What is that? That could definitely be some pond monster stuff. Hang on, let's go check that out real quick. Oh my goodness, what is this? Okay, that is definitely some droppings of some sort. Could be pond monster droppings. I have no idea. But this actually does look super suspicious. I've never seen this in the pond. Green ink. It's like a squid. When it inks or an octopus, when it inks, it inks black. But a pond monster might ink whatever this stuff is. Yuck. What is this? I don't know if you can see this on the camera, but if you can comment, down below what this stuff is. That's disgusting. Look at this, and there's like these weird bubbles. Something is going on here. Unfortunately, I don't have time to keep checking this out. We gotta get to the marina because we gotta go pick up my boat. We gotta go quick before this storm comes in. So let's go, let's go, let's go. Check it out, we got all the fan mail and we got so much fan mail today. Oh, this fan mail is for my sister, Grace Cher. Look how epic this one is. A teal envelope too. Okay, okay, there's so much fan mail in here, Cher. You are so epic. If you haven't already sent me fan mail, make sure to send it to me. The mailing address is in the link in the description below. You gotta send me family. I can't wait to open all this. But like I said, quick, let's go get that boat. Oh, shares, it may be a rainy day out, but check it out. We are here at a boat lot. We have a lot of options behind us too, but I think I know exactly the type of boat I want because this summer we're going to have so much fun. So if you haven't already, make sure to hit that subscribe button right now. And I'm also going to need your help to come up with a name as well as a color for this boat that we are about to get. So I wanna see a bunch of comments today commenting what color we should wrap the boat and what name we should call the boat. But check this out. Look, we are here at the marina and back here they have a bunch of random boats. I think some are old boats. Some are boats that are still new and working, but the boat that I have is actually over this way somewhere. I gotta go find it because I actually bought the boat and it's time for me to pick it up. So I'm super excited for you all to see it. And then we gotta take it out on the water to do a little test drive and everything like that. <gasps> oh, actually I see it shares. It's over this way and it looks so, so, so good. Oh my goodness, check it out. Oh, whoa, hold on. I don't wanna show you just yet because it's not all put together. This is interesting. It's one way to keep your boat nice and dry, but I feel like I I would not want to step on those steps to go down into the water. I feel like there'd be some sort of like pond monster or something. Oh, but also look how old that boat is. Look at this thing. It's got wood on the inside. That's super classic. Oh, and that boat's got a cool color, black and blue. I like that one a lot. Oh, and this boat right here is lime green. Oh, wait, they're actually calling my name carries. We gotta go. Okay, so we did the water test. We actually got the boat out. I uh, got the boat hooked up. We were ready to go back to the beach, but we had to stop to get gas. And let me just show you real quick what's going on here. So the gas station is not big enough to fill up the truck and the boat. I always forget how long the truck is. So I'm blocking this entire space here and then the boat is back here and it barely made it in just like this. We're gonna fill up the boats. We're gonna have to fill up when we get to the beach and then we're gonna somehow try to fill up the truck. I don't know how that's gonna work though. We're gonna have to go into a different gas station to fill up the truck. Pop the cap off. Filling it up. Here we go. I wonder how many gallons this thing takes. <laughs> Ooh, $95, wow. Now we gotta get gas in the truck. Let's see how we do this. Boom, and just like that, we are making this work. <gasps> It's not even full yet, and it's $129 to fill this truck. No! Oh, and it's still going. This is not good. And the final price, $142. Oh, no. That's like $250 already spent right now. Okay, wow, this is going to be an expensive toy, but uh, let's get home, pick up Mama Sarah, and let's head to the beach. <laughs> what did you get? You like it, Mom? Oh, do I like it? It's amazing. Can I see inside? Yeah, check it out. It's so nice. Look at the beautiful color, the leather. All right, well, we got to get it to the beach. Sounds awesome. Let's go. I'm going to go pack my bag right now. And then Cooper ah. and Otter can go in the boat, too. Come on, let's see if we can find your life preserver. Come, Come on. on, Otter. Otter, oh. go get your life vest. You can go on the boat. Cooper, do you think this is going to fit you? Oh, He yeah. wants to try it. Let's try 
Oh yeah, it works. It's gonna work. There you go, that looks awesome. All right, Cooper, you're ready to go. All right, Otter, let's give yours a try. All right, let's give it a try. Oopsie, come over here. Oh yeah, Otter, you ready to go? <laughs> He's so sweet, He's so funny. All right, well, we're gonna pack these up. All righty, and we will be ready to set sail. Okay, bye, Mom. Okay, we got the dogs in the back. They are ready to go. Shout out to my parents for driving the truck and the boat up. And then I'm going to take the test up. I'll meet them up there. We'll put the boat in the water and we'll get it going. We'll actually test it out. But it'll show you guys exactly how cool this boat is. Oh, and comment down below what we should name the boat. Bye. Have fun. Oh, yeah. They're off. I got to go hop in the test up. We got to get going. Remember, sir, comment down below what we should name the boat. Let's go. Woo. And just like that, we made it with the boat to the ocean. So we just gotta get it all set and ready to be put in. Oh, I'm excited. The water looks absolutely amazing. Check it out, my mom's down there checking out the water right now. It looks so good, so clean, so clear, and so calm, which is good, Shares, because my cousin is right there and she is terrified of boats. She'll go out with me on the jet ski, on a boat, she has a, a real like phobia of the water underneath her like moving and stuff. So this is gonna be very interesting. So everyone smash the like button for my cousin getting on the boat right now. She doesn't know that I just told you all that she's scared of the water, but I am a good driver, so it should be fine. Hey, wow. This thing looks great in the sun. Now we just gotta get everything put together. Gotta get the wakeboard tower up and everything. The boat's gonna look even better. Voila, and the boat is set up. Check out that wake tower. I love the canopy on top. I think it looks so good. I think we got everything ready. I think we're ready to officially launch the boat. So shares right now, everyone smash the like button. Hopefully everything goes to plan. It is high tide right now, so I don't think we'll get stuck on the bottom. Fingers crossed though, smash the like button for good luck. I think we're ready to back it in. Okay, I'm ready. Come this way. Oh my gosh, I love how my cousin is on the boat right now. She's so scared. Oh my goodness. Okay, so far so good. Just go straight, you'll be fine. Yeah, just go, oh, the water's cold. Okay, here we go. Boat is going in the water for the first time. Get ready for it. All right, slow, slow, slow. All right, keep going. <laughs> There's my cousin, she's freaking out right there. All right, and stop, hang on. This might be good. Now I'm just gonna disconnect the boat right here. Everything's off right now, let me just try to push right, it. Ready? Okay, there we go, now it's off. Boat is off. There we go. Now we have to put the engine down. Let's get this thing going. Here we go, we're putting the engine down and start this thing. Okay, boat is on. Now we're in reverse. <laughs> we're in reverse right now, we are in reverse. We are doing this. So far so good. I just don't want to be in too shallow of water, but I have no idea what the depth is. Let me just check. Okay, we're good. We're gonna turn around. It's gonna be embarrassing if I hit. <laughs> look at this. There we go. Now, look at that. Shoot. We're getting close to the dock. <laughs> Wait. <laughs> you didn't see that. Okay. That was scary. Okay, we're doing good. Well, we're on the water. We made it out. Okay, so I did freak out a little, but check it out. We made it to the ocean. We are on a boat in the ocean. This is so awesome, Sharers. Welcome to the new boat. Now I'm going to officially give you a tour. Check it out. Starting up here, my cousin is laying out. She's not too scared. Oh, scared? No. It's pretty calm. It's a pretty calm day. I mean, the sunset is gorgeous. We're in the ocean, and it's pretty calm water. And up here is called like chill lounge deck. Canning can spot. Can spot we can hang out up here just like this pretty nice you can fit at least two people maybe three people a third person up here and then we have our anchor system up here check that out our anchors in there but I'm not gonna anchor yet and then we have coming through here if you wanted to you can close this off door to close and then if it gets super cold you can close this windshield here and then you'll be super warm back here because you won't get any air coming in through there but we're not gonna do that today because it is a gorgeous day out so we'll keep that open but also there is storage underneath here wow that's quite a lot of storage and then I think whoa more storage under there we got our light vest there fire extinguisher flares all the safety requirements in there. We got our Bluetooth speaker system there. Back here, we got our nice dashboard for the passenger. Put some stuff in there. And then we got the awesome captain's chair here. Check this out. This screen is an entire iPad. Look at this. We can do so many different settings on here. This tells me exactly how deep everything is. I can zoom in. I can look at the channels. It's also pinch and zoom, which is nice, just like an iPad. We have so many different things. Oh my goodness, it's 30 feet deep here. 30 feet deep, that is really deep. Wow. Okay, well, I guess it's the ocean. 
ocean for you. And then you can see this is the fish finder, so you can see if there's anything big underneath the water. Right now, I'm not seeing any like crazy fish. I don't think any of this is fish, but if like a shark or something swam under, we would definitely see it on the screen. So that's kind of cool. And then there's just so many more settings on this. I'm gonna have to play with this thing. This is where I'm gonna be because I'm gonna be driving. But then back here, we have even more seats. And then this is one of my favorite spots in the boat. This is the sun deck. How cool is this? I'm not exactly sure how all this works, but this is probably my favorite spot because I'll be able to lay out here in the middle of the ocean on a giant bed. How cool is this? And then of course, if we wanted to get wet, we want to do some fun activities, have the awesome integrated wakeboard tower here. So you can hook up your ropes up here and we can wakeboard behind the boat and tube and do his super extreme sports, which we will definitely be doing this summer. You gotta comment down below what we should name this boat. All right, come up with a name. Share a boat. Share a boat, that's a cool name. All right, everyone right now, comment down below a name for the boat. I'm gonna pick up my dad on the dock. Let's kick this thing into gear and let's test it out. Friday night, we making moves. Me and all my friends, we get right. Feel so fly, we touch the moon. And we ain't going home when the clock strikes midnight. All right, we're about to go under power. Here we go. We about to turn it crazy like a Tarantino movie. Yeah. Getting up in the whip, we roll. All the glitters is really gold. We run the city, we don't walk on our tiptoes. There's a boat name for you. That one is called, oh, that one is called Real Laxing. Kind of cool, pun on words. I like that one. We don't need a plan, we get out of hand. But you know we stand a good time. Baby, this is how we do. We ain't going home when the clock strikes midnight. And just like that, the first successful boat trip, we made it back to the beach house. That's what I'm talking about. How was it? It was so much fun. You're not scared? No. See, I'm a good boat driver. I know what I'm doing. I drive it nice and smooth. Can't wait to see all your comments with name suggestions for the boat. Let's get creative. Let's create some cool names for the boat. Get ready for some awesome new vlogs coming your way. Grace is on her way here to the beach house, so we're gonna have some awesome fun with Grace. Turn post notifications, hit the subscribe button. I'll see you in the next vlog, and until then, you know what to do. Stay awesome. And share the love. Peace. Woo!